And every girl I get wild out tonight wild. Party in my house tonight Nation do a early morning, early Saturday morning Listening this song I feel as if it's party time This song from the entertainer who goes by the name Roger Wild the Same one the other day who went <laughs> the entertainer who went on stage and sprinkle, sprinkled what appeared to be obia powder or that is what the artist wanted the audience to think if i was an entertainer though i wouldn't want nobody feel as if me and sprinkle obia powder on them although someone said you know more likely uh, insect powder insect powder uh, but maybe a little baby powder who could tell well i'm a sense then sign no tonight a key key weed me fly go dubai still this song from Roger Wild, Wild Out Tonight. Energetic, full of vibes. You get that rockstar feeling. And the music video, the visuals. Big up to the editor, big up to the director as well. The song has to come party in my house tonight. To come party in the rap bat house. The settings, the scenery, the props, the dress code, everything about the music video just complement the song, the entertainer's image, and the character. And at the same time, I give up a vibes like, yes, a yes to the party there. She ride the wave like mermaid. She make you shake like Kirk. This could be the song for the summer, although a lot of people have it for say at TJ's Drift. Make me fuck up in ya. Drift. Molly V6. That have a nice piece of vibe too as well. Especially while driving. <laughs> V6 panic wall and it can't stop. How are the way back past that? Speeding kills though, so don't get too carried away with the song while driving. But look how far we gone and when I properly kick off the report. <laughs> Let's do this. Tef Nia Shandy Entertainment Feed Community Wagwan. What do you on the Saturday Freestyle Saturdays? Community members, enough love and blessings on the Saturday morning. Yeah. It is the damn weekend. What do you once again with the ENT news, the hot topics, the updates? So, with that said, let's kick off the report. Asthmatic shell. Boy, pick up spend shell. Mexican badness cartel. Four or five cent boy, soul go hell. Rest in peace and swell. Shell. Boy, pick up spend shell. Mexican badness cartel. Four or five cent more soul go hell. Rest in peace and swell. <laughs> Let us start off this one with a big congratulations to Sherika Jackson. Jackson ran her personal best and world lead in 10.65 seconds, the fifth fastest ever, as she retained her women's 100 meter title at the championships, well, the Jamaican championships, on Friday. Boy, pick up Spang Shell. Mexican badness cartel. Four or five cent more soul go hell. Rest in peace and swell. Nation Reggae Sumfest is this month and we know that a lot of entertainers will be performing, a lot of top entertainers, some of dancehall and reggae's finest and we know every year there are a few international and special appearance. Who I consider to be a special appearance, it is Stephen McGregor, the genius. He will be performing at Reggae Sumfest 2023. Yo, this is Stephen the Genius and on July 22nd I'll be performing live at the greatest reggae show on earth. Reggae Song Fest, you don't know, I'll be performing with my family, Chino McGregor, alongside the captain, the general himself, Mr. Freddie McGregor, and we will be performing with Dean Fraser and the Code Red Band. So just forward out, the ship will be sailing, we're going to sing some of the hits them, and some of the newer hits them. So just forward out. We know that Tommy Lee Sparta, he will also be performing at Some Fest, his first performance after being released from behind the bars. So at Some Fest will be his first performance, and over in Europe will be his first tour. Starting from the 26th of October, I will be hitting the stage in various countries across Europe, including Spain, Belgium, Netherlands, Germany, Sweden, France and Denmark. But that's not all, Africa as well, Kenya, Gambia and Ghana, Tamale Sparta will be touring Europe and also Africa. The Glock rise and squeeze and a bump in the face so your girl did a squeeze. The entertainment feed community, the song that I play right now, it is the official music video for the song titled Mexican Badness by dancer artist Rila Skell. Yes, I tile it all please, Kappa full him up, wasness and obese. Hungry dog, you're not ease. Martin, pick you up, take your body, gone freeze. The entertainment feed community, here is our next good visuals, extremely good visuals for a damn good song. Love the storyline. This is not just a music video, it is also like a short film. Well, it is a short film, and there are moments in the short slash music video that are just damn hilarious. You need to see the music video. The Glock rise and squeeze, and a bump in the face so your girl did a squeeze. The star recently shared an article with the headline. Shy Shy prepared for life as a single mom with baby Addy. 
So, with the China and the Vibes Cartel son Nickel Addy, you know, China as a child at one point, it's said to have been Little Addy's child. But around 3 DNA tests, though, China and the Shelly and Quran of Tea Time Talk with Shelly, on that show, they gave results for a DNA test that they stated that they did. Little Addy, on the other hand, on his side, they did up to two DNA tests, and they're stating that the child is not his. So, in total, as stated before, three DNA tests, though. With that out of the way, let's continue with the article. Shy Shy prepared for life as a single mom with baby Addy. Stung by little Addy's denial that he's the father of her child, Kayla Shy Shy Gardner has resigned herself to being a single mother and the main provider for her son. Earlier this year, in response to comments from vlogger Shelly and Tea Time Talk Run about the child's paternity, little Addy took to social media to blast her. He said that two DNA tests were conducted and both said that he was not the father. However, the child's mother, 20-year-old Gardner, told the star that she is confident that little Addy is her baby daddy. Me and the article continues but we just have to talk about this for a second. I don't really understand what is going on here. At the first me ever see something like this, both sides are claimed that them do DNA tests but on the two sides are different results. Little Addy, his DNA test. <laughs> Are the DNA tests that they did, it stating that he's not the father. China on her side, the DNA test that they stated that they did, the test is stating that little Addy is the father. What is going on here? Let us continue though. So she went on to say that she was young when she got pregnant and she stated that she wasn't sleeping around, it was just little Addy. The article continues so if you want to read more on that, I will provide a link in the description so you can check out the full article. But I guess the main reason for that interview is China stating that she is fully embracing the role as a single mom. Nation some more of the song Mexican Badness, the official music video. Me no left my gun at all. Stick to my body like a post up on a wall. Dop if you make well, we get the call. And just real as kill alone. The other day she was with super. We also have got that with the song titled She Said. Professor Nas did went to her home oh, and him say that him saw yellow man job. She said she no keep on man. She said she said she no keep on man. She said she said she no keep on man. The more man she have, more money in her hand. Nation. Did the dancehall artist Jada Kingdom do her lips? It seem as if she did. A lot of people are talking about it. Some stating that Jada Kingdom shouldn't have done her lips, while some are stating that it looked damn good. Nation, she your thoughts on that. Are you against Jada Kingdom doing her lip? Or are you with her? Stating that the lip fit her. State your thoughts in the comment section. We're moving on. Update on dancehall artist Joshi. I rather them than this a youth, yeah. Mr. Newsman, move. Get your facts right and not bring your news wrong. Yesterday, we got breaking news stating that six people from Josh's entourage injured in early morning shooting incidents. Lot of people were talking about the matter, lot of people shared their opinion on the matter. Dancehall artist Joshi, he took to social media where he shared this photo with the caption stating, Demo try your fuck, priors, hashtag, nothing like life. Bounty killer in the comment section reacting to that post. He wrote, Happy Earth Strong, blessings upon blessings, stay firm and strong kid, Ja is in control, priors. One time dancehall queen Carlene, she took to social media where she spoke on the matter, stating that no shooting took place at Mecca, nor was Joshi booked to perform at Mecca. Hi guys. Yes, I'm at Mecca Night Club. So last night, we had some drama. Nothing to do with Mecca Nightclub. Yeah, Joshi had his birthday party here. And let me make this clear Mecca Nightclub and the management team of Mecca Nightclub did not pay Joshi to be here. He wanted to celebrate his birthday here, and that was all on him. He came and purchased his drink. What is VIP table? Because we do offer those services. And of course, Joshua is our young upcoming superstar. So we would definitely have Joshua at, at Make a Night Club. And anybody who wants to arrange to have their birthday party here. So just to make it clear, guys, we at Make a Night Club did not pay Joshua the artist to celebrate his birthday here. That was his choice. Okay? Yes, we're having an after work party and jam right now. So, um, just to clear it up, 
um, there was a shooting incident last night on Constant Spring Road. No, oh, sorry, Yes, on Constant Spring Road, not at Make a Nightclub, which is inside Marketplace. There was absolutely no shooting at Make a Nightclub last night or any other night. Joshua Entourage apparently was shot up, but it did not take place at Make a Nightclub. So please, when you get in the stories together, and again, Joshua had his birthday party, and I'm thinking, I don't think he would be that stupid if he thinks he's in problem with people and would want to have his birthday party open. He advertised it, the club advertised it, everybody advertised it. Um, Otto was here last night, the party went well, finished, and everybody went home. Four o'clock, the party was finished, everybody went home, and the incident of question took place on Council Spring Road. All right, so again clearing up, make a nightclub at no shooting, no incident, no, not even a push and shove last night. Josh did has, have his birthday party here and it was awesome. He had a great time celebrating his birthday. He chose the club, had his VIP tables and stuff. You know, all the people who normally come to Triple Thursday was here. There was absolutely nothing wrong here last night. Um, as I told you, my life was here, Crystal was here, and we came home in peace, nothing happened. Again, Joshua, Joshi, was not paid to be at Make a Night Club last night for his birthday party. Nope, he was not. It was not his performing nothing or nothing, it was just him wanting to celebrate his birthday, and so he did it at Make a Night Club. Nation once again songs to check out got out she said Professor Nas did well to her Oh man him say that him saw yellow man job oh. She said she not keep on man She said she said she not keep on man She said she said she not keep on man The moment she have a more money in her hand Rila Skells Mexican Badness Cosmetic Shell Boy pick up spend shell Mexican Badness Cartel Four five cent boy soul go hell Rest in peace and swell Shell Boy pick up spank shell. Nation, that's right for now. You see what time o'clock, you see what time o'clock here, or you get the car here. Shell. And as Mexican usual, my people. In this cartel, four or five cent boy soul go hell. Rest in peace and swell. Shell. 